What's up, Pokemon fans? Welcome back to another Poke account. Last week, I probably insulted one or two or one or two people's uh, favorite Pokemon by including them in my top five ugly Pokemon list. However, since I had a week to wash out my eyes of the not so pretty images I gave you guys last week, I think now would be a good time to do a total 180 and look at who I think are the five most cutest Pokemon of all time. But uh, with 700 Pokemon out there, this isn't going to be a very easy task. Especially since I am a super fan of all of the dog Pokemon and water Pokemon. So to be fair, I will try my best not to be biased of my love of dog Pokemon. And give a mixed list of the top 5 most cutest, most adorable, and most huggable po Pokemon of all time. So before we start the list, to help me with this list is my special guest. Lily. And who are you, Lily? I'm your niece. And how old are you? Seven. And do you love Pokemon? Yes. What kind of Pokemon? Kid. Ki Kitty kittens. Pokemon? Mm -hmm. Alright, so hopefully, did you help me make this list? Yes. Do you think there's a kid Pokemon on the list? Yes. Do you know that because you made the list? Yes. <laughs> Alright, so let's get right into it, right? Mm -hmm. Okay, Lily, so what is our number fifth, or number five, cutest Pokemon on our list? Emoga. Emoga, alright. So do you know anything about Emoga? No. No, but you made, but you put it on the list anyway. Yes. Okay. Well, I'll tell you a little something about a Mulga, all right? Okay. So in every generation, there is a cute, tiny electric Pokemon that in some shape or way resembles Pikachu. Would you say that's true? Yes. Yes? So it is no wonder that one of them had to make this list, right, Lily? Yes. Yes? Okay. So this is a tough call because each of these electric sweethearts are so darn cute, although the Emoga sprite in the game doesn't look very good. It doesn't look like it would grant him a cute title. His appearance in the anime is what sold it for me. Is that what sold it for you too? Yes. Yes? This yes. little guy gave the audience so many oh kawaii moments, like where it says Emoga, right? Yes. Alright, so it gave so many oh kawaii moments throughout his appearances in black and white. All right, so moving on to number four. This is probably one of uh, Lily's favorite Pokemon. What'd you say? Number four is... Skitty. Skitty. A and kitten. A kitten Pokemon. A pink kitten, for that matter, right? Mm -hmm. So you are a lover of cats. Would you say that's correct? Yes. So can you tell me anything about Skitty? Uh, she is a cute Pokemon, and she's so fluffy, I want to kiss her on the head. She's so fluffy, you want to kiss her on the head. Okay, that's good. All right. Let me tell you some other information about Skitty that you probably don't already know, okay? <laughs> okay, yeah, you're still laughing back there. All right. So a Skitty is a pink, super cuddly kitten Pokemon that lets you chase its own tail for fun. Yeah, like I couldn't put this Pokemon in the top five. Right, Lily? Right. right. Yeah, she's still recovering from a laugh. It's okay. So there are a lot of really cute cat Pokemon throughout the series. <laughs> Apart from Pur Ugly, well, enough said. We already got that last week, but... Uh, <laughs> Skitty easily wins the cuteness award, right, Lily? Yes. Yes? Do you think it's evolved form? What does Skitty evolve into? Do you know? Uh, you know what it is, but you just don't know the name, right? Because yeah. you're only seven, so what do you know? Yeah. It is Del Kitty, or Del Caddy, right? Yeah. Yeah? You know what Del Caddy is, the purple one? Yeah. Yeah? Do you think Del Caddy is cute, too? Yes. Yeah? Because it's purple and it's fluffy and one kiss it on the cat. Okay. okay uh, all right, enough of that, enough of that. Even, even its Pokedex, <laughs> all right, that's good. Even its Pokedex entries describes it as adorably cute, which makes it highly popular. All right, so enough of that. And what is number three on our list, Lily? Cub Chew. Cub Chew. Do you know anything about Cub Chew? No, Do only you know? that he snorts out. Only icky that he. Snot. Only that he has icky snot coming out of his nose. Yeah. I mean, I'm gonna kiss him or eat him. You don't want to kiss him or eat him. <laughs> I don't think you. I don't, eat, I don't, think I don't you, want to eat him. You don't want to eat him. Okay, that's interesting. But I just don't want to. Do you know what? Do you know what cup she's evolved form is? No. It is bear tick. Do you know what a bear tick is? The big bear with the snot coming out of his nose too. Not really though, but okay. So obviously this is a bit of an odd choice. Cup Chew, the chill Pokemon. So his Pokedex entry is: their snot is a barometer of health. When healthy, their snot is sticky and the power of their ice moves increases. So when you read that Pokedex entry, you think, ew. 
but then you see this little guy and you just want to pinch its cheeks regardless of its tiny nose. It's so adorable. Unfortunately, it is smaller. Can I say something? No, I do not want to hug him and chew his little Okay, well, maybe, maybe some people want to do that, but not you. But unfortunately, in a similar situation to the other cute teddy bear Pokemon, which is Teddy Ursa, right? <laughs> it evolves into a big scary bear, and Teddy Ursa evolves into Ursarine, which is a superior bear to that. But, you know, that's uh, just my opinion. Not trying to be biased to you guys. Anyway, so with our number two cutest Pokemon is... Charmander. Charmander. So do you know anything about Charmander? Did you know he's that he's a fire type? He's a fire type. And, first one. and he's one of the original Pokemon, right? Mm -hmm. Yep, one of the three starters in the Kanto region, which is the first region, right? Mm -hmm. Okay. So, like uh, Lily said, he is one of the original Pokemon. You're one of the original starter Pokemon. So, this little guy was just so cute when he first appeared in the anime, waiting under the little shelter, waiting for his trainer to come back. He showed how loyal, loving, and trusting he was. And just look at the face. Charmander is without a doubt my favorite Pokemon ever. That's a lie. It's a lie. That was a joke. My favorite Pokemon ever is. Won't be revealed because I won't reveal I like it. Kitty Pokemon if you don't that's mind. why I won't that's why I won't be revealed because she likes kitty Pokemon. It's one of my favorite Pokemon ever. Let's just let's just say that. It's not my favorite, but it's one of my favorites. But despite that, his cuteness is what earned him the number two spot on my list. Our list. Right, Lily? Mm -hmm. But it's my list, because I said so. Okay. All right, Lily, so tell us what our number one cutest Pokemon is. Eevee, and I want to kiss your cheeks and so you wanna... much and pedal. Oh, okay, so okay. <laughs> so it's Eevee, so it's Eevee, and you want to kiss its cheeks because it's so fluffy, right? <laughs> yeah, she says yes, because she's laughing there in the corner. You can probably hear that. All right. <laughs> All right, that's enough. Shh. Quiet, quiet, too quiet. All right. So I am a little biased. There may be other cuter Pokemon out there, but personally, I think this little ball of fluff with its super bushy tail is just the most adorable Pokemon ever. And not only is it super adorable, but you also have seven more options of turning it into an even more super cute Pokemon. I mean, come on, Sylveon and Flareon are just adorable, and Leafeon and Glaceon and Vaporeon. Would you agree with that list? Uh-huh. Uh-huh. But, but obviously, Flareon's the best one. Right, Lily? No? I like Flareon, but who do you like? Leafeon. You like Leafeon? Why is that? Because it's a leaf type and it's so cute. And it's a grass type? Grass. Yeah. Yeah? It's just so cute. Okay. Well, she's seven, guys. What do what do you think she's going to do? Anyway. And anyway. Eevee has got to be the Pokemon who was, who was designed for the sole purpose of being super cute. I swear, the people at Game Freak must have sat down and went, Okay, let's make a Pokemon that everyone want to go, Oh, at, right? Oh, Because it's so cute. Right, Lily? Yeah. Yeah. So there you have it, guys and girls. My top five cutest, our top five cutest Pokemon of all time. This was actually a really hard list to narrow down because... Oh, cute. Really? Wait, because... I'm just trying to see you I'm finishing my speech here. Because there are just so many. Because there are just so po many Pokemon worth mentioning. Our honorable mentions would probably have to be Tokopi, Pichu, Growlithe, Butterfree, Spoink, and etc. You agree with that list? Because yes, you made the, I agree with the list. Because you made the list. But mm -hmm. it took how long would you say it took us to make this list? A couple hours, maybe. Yes. Yeah. We sat down and we just went right through the 700 Pokemon. Uh, but yeah, so, so what do you Ew. think? <laughs> yeah. So what do you, that. yeah, I know. So what do you think, Pokemon fans? Who do you think is the cutest Pokemon out there? Let, let me and Lily know. Let us know in the comments below. Until next week, guys, remember to catch them all. <laughs> See you guys later. Bye. Sign off, Lily. Say bye. 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 <laughs>